Hello guys and welcome to the channel. Today in this quick video I'm gonna show you what to do if Ripple Delete in Adobe Premiere Pro is grayed out and how to fix it. So stay tuned and let's get started. So if you're working in Adobe Premiere Pro and you're running into a problem that the Ripple Delete key combination doesn't work and even if you press the right click on the track and go to the context menu and try to choose Ripple Delete as you can see it is grayed out. The reason for that is because the video track and audio track are both synchronized. So when you try to ripple delete, it cannot delete it because it's synchronized with the video track. You have to either cut through both of them and then you can ripple delete no problem. But what if you don't need to do that? Then what you need to do, you just got to go to this icon right here that says toggle sync lock and you have to disable it. Just click on it. And you have to disable both of them because this video and audio track are both synchronized as well and they're synchronized to this one as well now if you go ahead and click on this segment as you can see the ripple delete is available and you can just click like that and you can also use your favorite key combinations as well because it will work the same way so i hope you find this video helpful if you like it please give it a thumbs up subscribe to the channel for more helpful adobe premiere pro tip tutorial videos if you want to learn more about adobe premiere pro and learn how to edit faster you can check out my adobe premiere pro tutorial playlist they will find a lot of helpful tools so definitely check it out and if you have comments or questions drop them down in the comment section below but this is it for now hope you have a nice day see you soon bye bye